a blessed day and welcome. This morning we will be meditating on the book of 1 Corinthians chapter 13 and verse 5. O rude, it does not insist on its way. It is not irritable or resentful. The last few days we have been meditating on what love is not. And as we continue to study God's word this morning, we learn that love is not rude. The Greek phrase for rude could literally be translated does not act unbecomely or does not act inappropriately. Christian love does not seek to cause problems and it does not belittle others. Christian love involves choosing appropriate actions and responses that help other people rather than bring them down. The fact is that rudeness is rooted in selfishness like every other sin and in context refers to words or actions that are offensive, hurtful or an embarrassment to others. British statesman and financer Cecil Rhodes, whose fortune was used to endow the world-famous Rhodes Scholarship, was a stickler for correct dress, but apparently not at the expense of someone else's feelings. A young man invited to dine with Rhodes arrived by train and had to go directly to Rhodes' home in his travel-stained clothes. Once there, he was appalled to find that other guests had already assembled wearing full evening dresses. After what seemed a long time, Rhodes appeared in a shabby blue suit. Later the young man learned that his host had been dressed in evening clothes but put on the old suit when he heard of his young guest's dilemma. Precious ones, those who genuinely love are never self-seeking. Rather, they are willing to go the extra mile to make others feel cared for. This morning, let us refrain from being rude in thought, word and deed. Let us continue to demonstrate true love through actions, for actions speak louder than words. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, help me to live a life that portrays your love in thought, word and deed. Help me never to be rude or hurt anyone. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Shalom Maranatha.